Hey everyone, it's Jackal Wolf back in Sky Factory 4 with another five minutes. That's how I did it. If you've been following along, you know that we are working our way through the advancement guide. Now, last episode, we did the bubble bubble and the slop in a bucket. Uh, this episode, we are going to focus on the You Cotton Be Kidding Me and the palm tree uh, advancements. Now, this is the, I guess, the cotton tree, which is how we obtain string and eventually wool. Uh, and then the palm trees is how we obtain sand. So, uh, to start, uh, we are first going to need to make ourselves some uh, water in our world. So uh, the easiest way of getting water without letting it rain into an open uh, cauldron uh, is to use saplings in a crushing tub. Now I've got 20 saplings here. Uh, 10 saplings will get you one full bucket. Uh, we're actually going to want to make a two full buckets so we can make ourselves an infinite water supply. And you can see I've got a, um, a little area set up right there and we're just going to keep jumping over and over again you can see the water is rising and any second now we there you go so this should be two full buckets so we're going to go one uh what are you waiting for that is a another advancement i actually completely forgot about that we're going to place that there we're going to grab you and we're going to place you there so we now have ourselves an infinite water supply we can pull it out and we can put it back in everything is good so let's pull out one of these uh buckets of water we're going to come over here we're going to fill up this uh oak cauldron now uh to make ourselves the uh cotton tree uh we're going to need to to make ourselves some mud. Now, there are a couple of different ways of doing that. We have made some mud over here uh, when we were crushing the acorns in that crushing tub, but you see, I don't have a full bucket here, and I'm gonna need a quite a bit of, of mud because I'm actually gonna need to use the mud twice. So a second way of making mud is by taking a, a piece of dirt and a cauldron full of water, right-clicking on it, and now we have a full cauldron of water. So this a cauldron full of mud is going to allow us to take things like this clay sapling. We're going to right click on it and we now have ourselves a jungle sapling. And I'm actually going to do this twice because we're going to need two uh, for this a cottonwood tree. Now jungle saplings are a vanilla sapling and you know we can plant it here and we can grow it up and get a bunch of uh, jungle wood. Uh, I'm not going to worry about that right now. One thing I want to do is I'm going to take this jungle sapling. We're going to place it on a drying rack and uh, given some time this this is going to dry into some vines. Now the vines are what we're going to need uh, for to make that cotton tree. Uh, so while we are waiting for that, let's come over here and let's actually twerk this up and we're going to get ourselves a, a couple more uh, saplings uh, rather than uh, have to do this whole process again the next time we need one. Uh, where is, there we go, there is my stone crook and that is actually a lot taller than I thought it was going to be. So can we not there we go. So we got all of that and let's get all of this wood while we are at it. And there you go. We picked ourselves a nine jungle saplings. That is absolutely perfect. And you can see that jungle sapling is now very quickly turned itself into some vines. So next we're going to come over here. We're going to place the jungle sapling the vines in a crafting table with three pieces of bone meal that gets us our cottonwood sapling. So let's move those out of there and you can see we've got our cottonwood sapling. Let's come over here. We're going to place it. We're going to twerk, twerk, twerk. And we got the advancement. You cotton be kidding me. Uh, there we go. That one twerked up really nice and quick. Let's go grab these leaves and there you go. We've also got uh, the advancement. You cotton something. Now that is the advancement for getting the uh, piece of string. And if we look there, we go. We got five pieces of string string in there. So that is one of the drops from the, um, I'm going to call it the cotton wood tree. Let's break this wood and grab up all that resin. So a very similar as to before, uh, we can use the um, cottonwood resin and the cottonwood acorns, uh, mix them together and we can make ourselves some amber cotton uh, and a couple of machines later on, we can actually turn that stuff into wool. Uh, but for now, all we need is this string and we can use that and we can make wool and do all that fun stuff with it. So uh, next up is the sand sapling. Now to make the sand sapling, we're going to have to start with some gravel acorns. Uh, we're going to take these gravel acorns, we're going to place them in a crushing tub and uh, very similar to how we uh, made the water, we're just going to jump up and down and you can see we are slowly picking up all these uh, acorns and if we are lucky we did not lose a single one we now have some sap in that uh, crushing tub that we can use later for other things as well but uh, we are now going to take the
these uh, eight sand acorns. We're going to place them in a crafting table with a petrified sapling and that gets us our sand sapling. So there you go. We have made the advancement palm trees. We're going to come over here. Let's place it down and we'll go twerk, twerk, twerk and get ourselves our first sand sap or sand tree. Let's go and grab those resources and grab that wood. And there we go. So we now have ourselves some sand resin and some sand acorns. If we come over here, we're going to go place them into our crafting table. We'll go one, two, three, four, and then the five pieces of resin, which is absolutely perfect. And there you go. We have our block of sand. So uh, that's going to be it for this one, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, please think about leaving a like and a subscribe. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at Jackal Wolf. Uh, also, check out the description below. There is a link to my Discord page. I would love it if you stop by to say hi. Uh, and as usual, I am streaming uh, every Saturday night modded Minecraft and occasionally throughout the week, depending on how... Um, interested I am in uh, playing the uh, some more modern Minecraft, but I would love it if you stopped by to say hi, and there is a link to my Twitch page down below as well. But uh, that is it for this one, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I will see you guys next time. Good.